to EA Sports continuing coverage of the postseason. I'm James Sabalski. Game three is set to go down. Great energy both inside and outside the arena tonight as we are just moments away now from puck drop. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Pittsburgh's on the attack. The Flyers look to start the transition game. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. And sends it just out of reach. Pass out front, and that's blocked in front. Oh, look at this. He's got a little jump. He's in, all alone. Stones him on the breakaway. Takes the shot. That's a fantastic sequence of saves there, James. He was so dialed in, he tracked it perfectly. They're all over the puck here, James. I mean, their opponent, they don't even have time to breathe. Oh, how did he get a club on that? What a stop by Anderson! They got a face on coming up here in the offensive end. And the goaltender looks fatigued, James. So the best medicine right now for them is to find a way to put the puck to the net. Raquel. Gain momentum up along the side. Puts it on net. Oh, what a save by Ayrson. And he slides it quickly to tip it. Handles it again. Moves it quickly over to Cates. And things starting to ramp up a little bit now on the ice with that play. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Fires it. Denied by the goaltender. Great reach with the poke kick. How did he stop that one? That's a great save, but the goaltender had to get out to the top of his piece, take away all the ice and make himself as big as possible. We haven't even hit the midway mark for the period. Still no score in this one. Ellers won the face off here in the offensive zone. Samola's moving it ahead. up along the wall by O'Connor. Poked away by Zamola. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. Broken up by Zamola. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Pad save with ease. Covers it up, we'll get a stoppage in play. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. And they win the draw here in their own end. Nice stick up to knock the puck loose. Tries to get it to Ferrari. Can't stay on his feet after that hit. The Penguins carry it along the wall. Takes a bump but still hangs on to the puck. Passes it over to Konechny. off the face off that's a solid check on the play graves carries the puck in his own zone picked up along the boards by hayes sends a pass over quick pass to plenty
The Penguins seize the moment and grab that all-important go-ahead goal up by one here in the back half of the first. Well, this is an earned lead, James, is that they've been first on the puck, they've been quick to it, they've dominated in terms of shots on net, and they found the back of the net. Now they can play with a different air of confidence and hopefully ride out the first and continue to hold the lead. Here's a short pass to Pedersen. Drills him! Big play inside the defensive zone. Here's a shot. Puck scooped up by Johnson. Passes it to York. Oh, what a hit along the boards! Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. Moves the puck along the half wall. And makes the save. Sends it quickly to York. Brink's got it along the boards. Philadelphia's got it in the neutral zone. What a move! Patterson's taking it from his own end. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the half wall. Philadelphia's in transition. A chance in front! Jari's got the puck and he's gonna hang on. More than half the period has expired. The Penguins have taken a 1-0 lead. The Flyers win the draw. Now let's see what they can do with it. Oh, a lucky break for the shooter as it goes off the inside of the iron and stays out. The Penguins have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. Philadelphia's won the faceoff. Oh, what a save in front! Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. Philadelphia's gonna start with the puck inside the offensive zone. to Graves. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. The Flyers gain control of the puck. Slides the puck across to Cates. Less than a minute to go here in the opening frame. Cates has an uncanny ability to know exactly where he is on the ice and who is around him. I mean, he stumbles and he's barely able to hold on to the puck with the lack of balance but he finds the open player who gets a great scoring chance. Big hit, and that frees up possession. And with that, the first period is in the books. Both teams with a chance and a refresh will get a clean sheet of ice and come back with period number two. Still tied, but let's see if somebody can open things up here. Now, 
Cheryl, how do you sum this one up for the first 20 minutes? The Flyers are lucky that this game is tied, James. I mean, they've had the minority of the shots and really haven't found a way to get to the interior of the ice. They're going to have to pay the price somewhere if they want to get some shots and make this game a game. Moves it to the middle. Oh, and he comes up with a stop. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. We're still in the early stages of this period. It's all tied up. Pittsburgh's won it. Now they'll go on the attack. Now a quick pass to Hayes. Huge steal in his own end. Locks him. The Penguins gain possession. And it's a quick pass to Pedersen. The Penguins played along the wing. Oh, they telegraphed the pass, and he picks it off. Here's a chance, and that goes off. The club play continues here. The net has been a workhorse tonight, James, and there's just another example of it, and the entire bench knows that they're invigorated by it. I mean, he's on his way down, he's stumbling, and he manages to find the puck and get a shot on net. That's tenacity at its best. Moves it to the middle, and that's intercepted. Here they come on the attack. Shot, and he makes the save. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Centers glide into the dots. We're ready to get things back going again. The Penguins win it. And he slides it quickly to Latang. And he takes the feed into the offensive zone. Sends it over. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. Lawton's won the face off, and I don't see what they can do. Gets in front of it by laying out. And he's knocked off the puck there. Quick feed to Beauvillier. Excellent stick work on the play. Tries to get the puck over to Johnson. Moves it to Paling. And somehow he hangs on. Moves the puck. On the attack into the offensive end, right up the gun. He's got a step. Stopped on a breakaway. What a save he made there. Well, I loved how he challenged the shooter on this, James. He didn't sit back in his net. He came right out to the top of the paint. He said, if you're going to beat me, you got to find room. Still lots of time left here in this frame. We got a tie game. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Break out. And down he goes as the puck 
goes free. Picked up by Aho. Retreats with the puck inside the defensive zone. The Penguins will play it in their own end. With possession along the wall. Feeds it down low. Slides it across. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Past the midway mark of the frame. It's a 2-1 hockey game. Philadelphia's won the draw. Sandheim's been slashed. Penalty coming up. Kate's setting up against the wall. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Well, it's kind of hard to protect a one-goal lead when you're sitting in the box and your team's shorthanded, James. The PK units can have to find a way to stave off the power play here and get the job done. Man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, they earn this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. Good read with the stick to break that up. Moves it quickly over to Tippett. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. And they get the puck out of harm's way. Picked up along the wall by O'Connor. Across the point. Great reach with the poke check. Looking to break out here on the power play. Hasn't been a very good one so far. Haven't even registered a shot. The tough negated entry. They're going to have to find a way to get in and get set up. Ellers lugging the puck. On the heels of their blades trying to get it out. And we've got an offside with a face-off looming. Glass and company still shorthanded here as they get ready for the faceoff. Couturier's won the draw. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Gives them nothing in front. This is a dialed in goaltender, very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low slot and makes the save. Gets in front of the shot. Rocks him on the play. Kells, penalty is almost expired. The Penguins get back to even strength as the penalty killing unit delivers. Two on one, here we go. Oh, tremendous save to shut down the rush there. Wow. More than half the frame has been played here. The Penguins are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Philadelphia's got the puck inside the offensive zone. Teams are lined up and we are ready to take this draw. And a nice save there as play continues. Jari's been dominant in the piece tonight. He's turned away a lot of high danger shots and he's really found a way to build some momentum for his team, give him a real opportunity to win. Chase has it in the defensive end. Bank pass off the boards. Great read with the stick. Slides it diagonally to all alone. Makes the save. Oh, and this is a great save. You can see this one on one battle. And the goaltender is so dialed in, shocking, and makes that save. Quick pass to Frost. Hangs on to the puck after taking a hit. Jari's gonna hang on to the puck for a whistle. Here in the late goings of the period, it's 2-1. Pittsburgh's taking possession in their own end. The Penguins should play from the defensive zone. Here's a short pass to Konechny. Nice poke check. Moves it to Malkin. And he's tripped up on the play. Referee's hand goes up here. Let's get the official decision. 
And coach is looking for an explanation here from the official. Yeah, I mean, he's getting the refs here because he wants to know why his team is being penalized more often and is clearly having a factor in the game. Philadelphia's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. They haven't scored on the power play yet, but they have another opportunity. The key to this one, gain possession so they can set up. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Knocked away in the offensive zone. Quick feed to Forster. Tripped up on the play. Delay penalty coming up. The Flyers will take it behind the net. Scores! Well, who needs the man advantage for the extra attacker as they quickly strike? Well, they had possession. They recognized the land. And to be truthful, the defensive structure, well, they just collapsed and played soft. you got to be able to attack, and then result, a goal. Well, it takes hard work in the intangibles to get available for a one-timer in that low slot area. You know it's going to be a grind. You're going to have to fight for your space. He does a great job of it and buries it home. Philadelphia's offensive pressure has resulted in an equalizer here tonight. As an athlete, you always know the end of the period is critical time, and you want to maintain pressure, and you want to gain momentum heading into the third. That goal did just that. And now he angles it across to Beauvillier. Receives the pass. Stopped by the goaltender, getting a piece of that one. Philadelphia's got it along the wall. Can't get a hold of that pass. Big hit on the play, and there's the whistle. As it looks like the pane of glass is broken. Well, the good thing is, James, that the glass doesn't shatter like it used to, and they can just replace the pane, but they'll have to do that because everything is about safety first. Glass slides into the face-off dud, and they'll continue to try to kill off this penalty. Pittsburgh's won the face-off deep in their own end. And he slides it quickly to glass. Just moments away from the resumption of this power play. They're ready to drop the puck here for this faceoff. Philadelphia's got a hold of the puck. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Here's a pass in front, and that's intercepted. There it is. That's a wrap for period number two. Both teams will get a chance to get a little breather here. And we'll come back. Third period action next. Fans, don't forget to get the seats you want to the games you want by purchasing one of our six-game ticket packets today. Welcome back to EA Sports, your home for all things hockey. Sabalski, pounder, and here comes the third. Philadelphia's won the opening face-off, and their power play continues. Works it across to Eller. Getting a little physical out there, but still holds on to the puck. Now a quick pass to Konechny. The Flyers looking against the half wall. Passes it over. Stopped by the goaltender. More time off the clock as they grab the puck. Good stand-up hit on the play. Puck move back to the neutral zone. Quick pass across to Frost. The man advantage is over. That's a great job by this PK unit, James, creating some momentum for their team and getting out of it without getting scored on. And this is critical, given that it's a tie game. And a great save! Moves the puck into the attacking area. Loses his balance on the play. Right up Main Street and on the attack. Oh, excellent play and goal there! He looks deep to Malkin. The Penguins played along the boards. Chance in front! Oh, denies them with the paddle save! Passes on over to Lawton. Shot! Long jam in front, that's broken up. Moves it quickly over to Rust. Scooped up along the wall by Crosby. Nice zone entry from the left. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Stop! Just fantastic. 
fantastic is to be able to pull the goaltender to the side that he wants and then to just lay it home. He doesn't even have to elevate the puck. He uses the low part of the net. The Penguins now have the lead here in period number three, and it's crunch time now. It is crunch time, and it's crunch time, James. I mean, it's been back and forth all game. Now you find yourself in the lead, so you have the momentum. You've killed your opponents, so continue to hold it. Continue to apply the pressure. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. Into the corner now. Dishes it off. The Flyers have it from their own end. With authority. Chance in front. Point to point pass. Quick pass to Johnson. And he takes the dish. Slides it on over to Delorier. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Here's a chance. Stops that one. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. And that's knocked away by York. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. Some solid defensive work in the road end with the poke check. Blocked in traffic. Enters the offensive zone from the left. Philadelphia's got the puck in their own end. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Puck moved over to Tippett. There's a chance in front! And he shuts down a great scoring chance there! have the advantage in shots tonight, but they still find themselves trailing here in the third period. Pittsburgh's got it in the defensive zone. And he passes it up ahead to Bemstrom. Oh, did the rink rattle after that collision in the corner. Great read in the offensive zone by Tippett. With the blast! That's blocked! Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Works the puck in his own zone. Takes the feed. Comes up with the stop. Jostling for the puck, but still moves away. Here's a shot with the stop. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs off. Here in the back half of this period, 3-2 is where we sit. It's a one-goal game in what has been a very fun contest to this point. at this moment. Up along the wing. That knocks him off the puck. Here's a short pass to Carlson. And now it's over to O'Connor. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the boards. And he gets in front of that. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Here they come down the right side and on the attack. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Sends the pass over. From center they get into the attacking area. Passes it over. Handles the pass. Wicked pass. And that's blocked. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Oh, he hit him and caught all of it. Oh, that's a tough one, James. You're along the boards. They don't have a lot of give. What that means, you're feeling it all. Slides the puck ahead to Brink. Quick shot. Oh, Waffle boards it to keep it out. 
Yari's in such great position. He's able to redirect that puck to safety right to the corner. Big time stop there. I absolutely love this save, James. I mean, the shooter's in a point-blank range right in that low slot, and it's just taken away. Grand Larson. Oh, wow, what an incredible save. I don't even know how he got to that. That's fierce athleticism to be able to get back to the net and make that save, James. That was amazing. Taken by Malkin. The Flyers gain possession in their own end. Tippett's crossed the line and gained the zone. Here's a shot, and it tears off the glove and it stays out. Well, the shooter's in a coveted spot on the ice, right in the middle of it with a good look, and he makes an incredible save by getting square to the puck and turning it aside. They fight for it along the boards. Takes a hit but still hangs on to the puck. Directs it on over to Couturier. Shot! They score! They've tied it up! They have tied it up here with a big time goal in the third! Well, they couldn't have waited much longer there, James, as they're running out of runway, but they found a way to get it done. You gotta come up big at the right moment, embrace the pressure, and that's exactly what they did. Well, he had his eyes on the puck. He tracked it perfectly and got himself set to position, James. I thought he had it. He got a good chunk of it, but he didn't get it all. game management, keeping the game close, knowing exactly where you are and how much time you have left, and all of a sudden you kick it into another gear, you score that equalizer, and guess who kicked into another gear? The coach with his reaction behind the bench. The Flyers' last goal, Cheryl. Huge. It is massive, isn't it? And the timing is impeccable. Right at the end of the game, you find a way to get the equalizer, and this really puts the opponent on their heels. It tightens up their stick, so they have to attack and find a way to get to the net. Moves it to Sanheim. There's a hit on the play. Less than 60 seconds to play in this tight one. Dishes it off. Puts the puck on net. Blocked in front. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. The score! It's in the back of the net. Try to pick a winner next. Hey fans, we'd like to draw your attention to the far part of the arena that will welcome all of our minor hockey games here in the tonight. 
The moment of truth has arrived. Overtime is set to go. Puck is dropped and OT has begun. Therapy's cut it against the boards. Fires it on net. Only oh, gets a blocker on it. What a stop by Chari. Back to the point it goes. Penalty save and he made it look easy. Great job there. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Gaining momentum along the wing. Angles it over to Frost. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Takes a shot, and he's got the answer for that one. Across the line, down the left wall. Quick feed down low. Sends the feed in front, and that's stopped. A big draw looming here in the offensive zone. Couturier's quick stick off the draw wins possession. Feeds it over. Stopped by the goaltender. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. A big face-off here inside the offensive end. Philadelphia has won the draw, and they'll go to work. Pittsburgh's got the puck. Here they come up along the wing. Here's the chance in front. Great defensive heads-up play to pick it off. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Tries to feed it over to Sandheim. Oh, we got a piece of it to keep it out. Slides it diagonally to Latang. And he takes the pass. Fantastic save! Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. This is a face-off. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. Moves it quickly over to Tippett. Latang's picking up steam. Knocked off the puck. And that was read perfectly. What a play by O'Connor. Beauvillier's got it along the wing. Sends the pass down low.